So today I received this uh, really cool Geiger counter uh, for supporting the SafeCast uh, Kickstarter project. Um, it's essentially a radiation detector. Um, here in my room I'm reading uh, random background radiation levels of about 45 counts per minute right now. Um, you can see it there, the readings are shown on the display. Um, but uh, yeah, I wanted to test out um, the Geiger counter to see how it would react to something that gave off a little bit of radiation. Um, so I actually have one of these um, tritium vials that uh, contains a small amount of tritium gas which gives off uh, beta particles and causes the keychain here to glow. You often see these on gun sites or uh, you know other maybe military applications. Um, so right now we're still reading in the uh, low 40s. Uh, I'm not sure if you can hear the uh, uh, count indicator there that's beeping. But I'm going to go ahead and hold the uh, tritium up to the uh, detector and we'll see uh, what sort of counts we get. Right now we're rising to about mid-50s. Now we're at 60 counts per minute, 70 counts per minute. Um, So it's definitely rising, we're about 90 right now. Of course this is a, just an average over time, so it takes a second for it to really get a, an average reading. Now we're over 100. I'll go ahead and uh, show you the screen here so you can get an idea of where we're at right here with the... Uh, So anyways, um, looks like we're at about uh, 135 or so right now. Um, I was a little bit surprised. I didn't realize that uh, that beta radiation would penetrate the uh, vial, but as you can see, it clearly does. Um, and uh, But it's been a useful indicator to show that the uh, Geiger counter is in fact working. So I'm um, definitely looking forward to... Uh, yeah, experimenting around with the uh, SafeCast uh, Geiger counter and uh, seeing what I can do.